But watch out for the stink face. The following is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from the Isle of Samoa. Weighing in at 425 pounds, Rikishi. Not only an all-time great, but the father of Jimmy and Jey Uso. The real person responsible for their tag team prowess, Saxton. And their dance moves, too. Hey, guys, you think Rikishi would give me a dance lesson? Absolutely not, Saxton. With any luck, you'll get a stink face. No, no. Rikishi wouldn't do that to me. I mean, there's got to be a surreal moment. How nervous are you right now in the ring? He can't get lost in the magnitude of the moment because he has to prepare for an encounter with the Beast Incarnate. Here comes the Beast. The most dominant competitor in WWE history. his opponent from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar! Brock Lesnar's been a dominant force his entire career. Brock Lesnar has made a career out of steamrolling whoever has dared get in his way. You think there's any limit at all to the carnage that's to come here tonight? Oh, Saxton, you know better. We should expect nothing short of total decimation. Of course, Lesnar's never one for holding back. The Beast wins decisively. The Beast wins by ripping guys apart. This is a match where these special WWE superstars take it to the max. To the extreme, there are no rules. As an agent of chaos myself, I've had a little bit of a soft spot in my heart for extreme rules. Uh, there's no question that extreme rules is in a category all by itself. Well, some people look forward to Halloween. Some look forward to New Year's Eve. Me, personally, I look forward to every extreme rules match on our show. And forth looking for the advantage here. Ah, oh, what a smash! That is just insulting. Oh my lord! Now he's been put on the defensive. And what a maneuver we just saw there. Rikishi is picking the competition apart. Yeah, Rikishi isn't giving any quarter. Answering back! strategy almost has to be to have no strategy. Well, you do need preparation. You have to accept that you're walking into an unstable situation and be adaptable. But not being locked into any one plan would be smart in this kind of chaotic environment. Oh, man. Rikishi is a man on a mission now. Quick return to the ring. Uh-oh. Big knee to stop the maneuver. Uh-oh. Hits him with the counter. Lesnar wards him off. Down he goes. Boom! Slam! With authority. Boom! Running FTO plants him. Nicely done. Solid punch. 
What a headbutt. Vicious. Setting up. Strong kick out, but you have to wonder if he can keep it up. Being carried around with ease. Starting this play of power. I've seen he can end it here. Getting the shoulder up before two. An emphatic kick out, and there's still a lot of game left here. WWE Universe wants tables. Well, they've got tables. He's back into the ring. Draped across the ladder now. Uh, I think we all know how this is going to end, guys. Inside the ring. Uh oh. Rikishi finds his target with that one. Lesnar is overwhelmed. Lesnar is overwhelmed. I must give credit. Catching Brock like this is an incredible challenge. Oh, he fights Rikishi back. I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. And he's taking this to the outside now. Oh, the chest! Oh, the reversal by Rikishi. Boom, running at Dio Clanton. Nicely done. The steps cut. I hope he just wants it. Outside. This could be good. Oh, look at this. Oh, is he going to tap out? Put her in a foam, he does. In trouble here. And oh, what a great counter. That'll break it up.
saw it coming, taking advantage. And he has an answer for Rikishi. What's coming next? Taking their time. Oh, puts that gut. I think the win right out of him. And Brock keeps handing out even more damage. I think Brock is forming a plan to end this conflict soon. Turning for Rikishi as he ascends up the ropes. Shaker! Rikishi may have put the exclamation on this one. Got a shoulder up before three. The scary thing is, this is ordinary for the Beast Incarnate. It's going to take a lot more to keep Lesnar down for the count. And I think to get the pinfall, you have to try that maneuver one more time. Turn out the lights, the party is over. Oh, shaker. That spells trouble for Lesnar. Two. Oh, okay. Not keep him down for even one at this point. Just dished out his most devastating offense. And you gotta be wondering if he's big knockdown. Oh, looking for it. Back body drop. Just having his way right now. 
It is scary how much Lesnar enjoyed on the middle rope. up the score. Big punch finds its mark. He climbs into the ring. Coming in hot. Outside the ring now. He has no need to rush. And Rikichi with a counter. He weathered the storm and wants to create a flurry of his own. Vicious right for him.
Suplex canceled that move. And he's able to counter. Oh, loving blow. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. That's a true. Rikishi is picking the competition apart. Yeah, Rikishi isn't giving any quarter. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Scooped up. Here it comes. Rikishi. Driver. Rikishi may have put the exclamation on this one. He gets the late score. Big forearm. Oh, he fights Rikishi. Oh no! Lesnar's about to end this! <laughs> One more time throwing the heavy artillery. Ten. And he got one. Ah, oh, the reversal by Rikishi. Here is your winner, Brock Lesnar! I can't imagine being able to celebrate, let alone stand, after a match like that. That's just the risk every superstar takes when they step between the ropes. You just always hope it doesn't happen to you. Certainly some rare.